great experience for us to be aware of. Okay, Vera, we would love to hear the affirmations and how they can help us. Well, I just had like different steps that you can do um, because every, every word we speak has energy. So number one would be like define intent, be clear about what your affirmations are. And then the second one is choose your words. You know, mirror that energy that you want to manifest. And then speak with belief. That was what we were talking about earlier. And um, it's like pronounce with concise intent, basically. And then action. Align the words with, with uh, energy, movement, doing things for it. And then the most important part, because this is what I would do wrong. I don't know if it's wrong, but I would do not good enough. It would be let go and release any outcome that you wanted. Just allow it to flow and see what happens. And it's sometimes and more often than not better than what you wanted before. Amen. Or that you were searching for. Amen yeah. to that. So. Because sometimes when we want to control it, yeah. it's like if we get out of our own way, mm -hmm. the other side is going to manifest something that's way better than we way better. were expecting. It's incredible. Yeah. yeah. So that's it. Yes. It's like, it's like, what do they call it when we, with software, we upgrade? Yes. And that's what we're doing with our brain. We're upgrading. Um, oh, I love that. Yeah, yeah. And the universe upgrades for yes, us. Yes, exactly. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah. <laughs> I met a man on.